This is Coyote News. The Coyotes hosted Weber State on Saturday trying to rebound from a road loss to start the season. After three turnovers, the Coyotes found themselves in a 21 to nothing hole less than eight minutes into the game. Quarterback Chris Strebler accounted for six total touchdowns and sparked the comeback by running in two straight touchdowns and adding a throw to Shamar Jackson, making the score 28 to 21 at halftime. USD found themselves down three touchdowns again in the fourth quarter when Brett Van Rokel hurled in a one-handed 42-yard touchdown. With just 27 seconds left in the game, Jackson caught his second touchdown, capping the largest comeback in Missouri Valley football history. In the second overtime, Miles Bergner kicked a 34-yard field goal to give the Coyotes the 52-49 victory. The win moves the Coyotes to 1-1 one one on the season. They travel to Grand Forks Saturday to take on UND for the first time in five years. Coach Nielsen says he's proud of how the team fought back. Football is a, a game that you know, is a tremendous momentum game and, and uh, you know, certainly very proud of, uh, of our football team and the way that they hung in there and, and battled back and found a way to, to win against that Weber State team that I think is a pretty good football team. And I think they showed that today. USD quarterback Chris Strebler took home Missouri Valley Football Conference Offensive Player of the Week honors for his performance against Weber State. And kicker Miles Bergner won Special Teams Player of the Week. Strebler threw for 173 yards and ran for 125. He accounted for a career-high six touchdowns. Bergner kicked a game-winning 34-yard field goal in double overtime. He also made all seven of his extra points and pinned two punts inside the 20-yard line.